it's what have princess welcome back for another vera bradley haul this one is a mix of items there are two items from amazon and they were just items that weren't available anywhere else they're through the normal vera channels but i really wanted them so i got them and the other items are from vera bradley um, retail side so all right the first two items are these pencil pouch trios I bought, if you remember, two of these already. I bought the uh, other ones from the paper store. I bought the Pretty Posies and the Shore Thing. And they come with three different ones in three different sizes and three different patterns. This particular one is Romantic Paisley. So this is the one I just got. Um, I really like these. They're all on this little loop that has that quick release clasp. So you can take them off and they all have little metal things to do. So you have a small, medium, and large. And I like the material. It's it's like a, a thin nylon. This one actually feels a little more robust than the other one. It just could be because the other one's a little more broken in. But they're not lined, but they are like water resistant. They're kind of a, not a true plastic thing, but just a nice nylon thing. Very wipeable anyways. Um, but they're very, very good because in a smaller bag, for example, I just did a what's in my bag with the sling. And so this would not be the best choice, but for the smaller pieces, because they're so thin and lightweight, they really are great. Um, and the zipper opens up and you can kind of get in there and really find what you're looking for. I just think they're great for all sorts of things. I use them especially when I'm traveling. So I got Romantic Paisley and I also got the Kaleidoscope because now with the four different sets, you can kind of pick one of the patterns that will match almost any of the bags I have in some form. So just some different options to, to pick and play with. Um, but they're all the same, same construct. So two new pencil pouch trio sets. Um, I don't know why those are not available through the normal Vera channels. I, I find that strange um, that they do that, but sort of an exclusive item from outside channels. The next item I got is these cozy slippers. These are obviously the foxes super cute and they're like pinker than I thought they would be it I, doesn't bother me at all actually I just thought they were going to be more of an oranger versus a pinker I, I kind of like the way that they are but super cute so so very soft and a great fit these are the size large so they fit size 9 to 10 shoe size and they fit really well they have a little bit of elastic in the back just enough to kind of help hold it on your foot but they fit really well and have the non-slip thingies on the bottom. I do already have several pairs um, of various slippers, but those are really fun. All right, this is just a luggage tag and this is Deep Night Paisley. I got this to go actually with my um, Lay Flat Travel Duffel and Deep Night Paisley Neutral. I know it's not quite the same pattern, but since they don't make performance tool luggage tags it's close enough all right the next item I got I really like the Hadley backpacks I'm very sad that they're going away I do like the new small backpacks but it's not the same so I had to get another Hadley I have I don't even know how many now but but this denim one is nice because it'll go with just about anything and I think because of the material it'll wear very well over the long term I'm not super keen on the inside, it's sort of a generic interior. Um, it does have the multicolored dots because this was the interior they used for a lot of the microfibers. And uh, anyways, it's fine. It's just, I think it could have been more fun with a denim, something more blue or denim. Anyway, ah, it's a nylon interior as well, which I sometimes like, sometimes don't, it's fine. Okay, so it's a Hadley. It has the zipper pockets on the side, which if you want, you can put a water bottle in them. It's just not optimum because you have to put the water bottle and then kind of zip up the side um, to kind of hold it in place. It's not, it's not really, it doesn't seem like it was designed for that to me, but both sides are the same. The main pocket is a double zipper. You open it up. It, it doesn't open that far down, but about halfway and it has an interior zipper pocket which goes about halfway down and then on the front 
You also have a slip there and a slip there. So two big slips. And then just a big main pouch, which is actually pretty roomy, believe it or not. Nice smooth zippers. And then the last pocket is on the back. It has that, um, the tech pouch. And it does have a pocket here, which is big enough for the phone, but I don't put my phone there. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so Hadley backpack. Nice, really adjustable, padded. I like it, I like it a lot. So that goes in the Hadley collection for a purse backpack for me. Also great for a day trip backpack, but speaking of day trips, there's the day tripper backpack. This one is in Holland Bouquet. This is the uh, partner pattern to Holland Garden. And it's a nice black base with grays and it actually has um, some of those pretty pastel colors in there as well. I don't think they come across as well in the video, but like you have your blue and pink and peaches. The interior is very peach. So you can kind of see from back here. It's very peach. It's a light color. The thing that's good about the light color is you can find your stuff inside there because most everything you have is usually like a darker mix. So it's easier to find things. It's brighter inside, but it's also light, so it will get dirtier faster. But it is a little bit wipeable. You have a slip here and then four pin, pin slots there. And that's your front pocket. And there's a single zipper. You also have this straight across zipper pocket on the front that I was playing with. Then you have your main pouch, which is that clasp closure. And it also has a drawstring. It is in a lot. It's not elasticized, it's just a nice rope drawstring, but it has that slider to kind of hold it up. Inside that pouch, you have an, a nice padded slip here that's the full length of the bag. And on the front, you have two big slips here. So very functional, and look at how roomy that is, actually. For a small backpack, it's very, very good organization and very good space, actually. I like the proportions a lot. I have another one in Firefly Garden, but so this is only my second one of these, but I really, really like the first one. Um, this pocket right here runs the full length of the bag. You can put just about any big folders or anything like that or any small flat items, whatever you want, really. Um, for me, if I'm using this and I want to put my laptop in this back slip or in the laptop tech pouch, which is padded, um, even my big laptop does fit in there, then I would put my iPad in this front one so you can take two things. Now, just realize the front one isn't padded, so it's probably not intended for that, but you, you could do whatever you want. Um, on the back, it has this nice handle, it has nice straps that are well padded and robust, and you have the trolley sleeve as well. So really, really very functional backpack. It is lighten up material, so it is water resistant as well, and will be pretty durable. So that concludes this haul, but another one to follow. Stand by for more. Take care. Bye for now.